Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, I'm Jeff. This is Will to Live Outdoors, and this is my Bronco Raptor. And this past weekend, finally got it out and was able to, to do a little wheeling. Went to the Hot Springs Off-Road Park. I'll give you a little teaser clips here. Uh, the vehicle did just absolutely phenomenal. Uh, still getting used to just how, how wide this vehicle is when you're taking it down a trail, but uh, all in all, it was just an absolute bat blast. Um, if you've watched one of my uh, previous videos where I showed how easy it was to take the uh, fog lamp assemblies and the raptor steps off the side of the rock rails, um, thank you. Uh, but uh, I'm going to show you just how easy it is real quick to put those steps back on. Uh, thing got a little bit a uh, little bit muddy this weekend so I'm gonna give it a little bit of a bath and see what it looks like topless and uh, show you just how easy of a task that is and I'm gonna do it by myself uh, so uh, we'll see if we run into any issues there uh, but uh, thanks again hope you enjoy the video we're gonna get right into it Dentions there are a, like a, a slotted like right there. All right, so it's obviously kind of like anything else that you'd see like that. That little piece right there is going to engage in the hole, and then it just kind of like slides back into there, and it's held. Gravity keeps it up there. That way, one person can easily lift these up and get them installed. I mean, it's, it's in, that's, that's all it takes. Anyway, we'll move on to the next side and then get this thing washed off. Thank you. 
そうなのよ。Alright。To take off this back portion, first thing we're going to do is remove the washer hose. We're going to remove this connector. Both will secure and store right here. And then we're going to take off one, two, three, four bolts here. And at the top of the C pillar, let's get a look at this bolt here. Right there. You can see it. Yep, right there. Get that one on both sides. To clean that ground off there. So that's it with the roof off. That was one man, one man show they're removing that. So it can be done. However, I would recommend though to have a plan of how you're going to get it to the ground without running the risk of damaging uh, the back glass. Uh, that's the tricky part. So I would recommend possibly using some sort of like a those racks that they use in like a body shop because this thing doesn't really weigh that much and they've got foam on them so you can put a couple of those that way you've only got to just uh, get down a little a little ways um, but when you're six foot two that's a long ways to the ground just FYI there it is Looks actually uh, really, really cool with the uh, with the top off. Not too terribly hard of a task to do. Got a do couple of locating tabs which uh, sit down inside here. Once you're free of that, it's pretty pretty easy from there. But uh, anyway, I may get some like uh, some sort of something there just to keep that from getting scuffed up in the future. Kind of like what they've got here. Got a little. We'll look at that. Yeah, the raptor steps are super easy to take on and off, and you can do that without any help whatsoever. And it takes like five minutes to do that task. Uh, both uh, the panels can be taken off. Uh, the front two and the middle long one can be, that's, that's a one person job. And again, this back one, have a plan in place and a friend, or just be prepared to, uh, to think quick, because like I said, it's a long ways to the ground. And if you drop that on a corner, it is very possible that you could break the corner of your mic top. And with the supply chain problems, that may be quite some time before you could get a replacement. Anyway, it is uh, super lovely outside and uh, that top is off. So I think uh, right now I'm going to go um, just go for a ride and enjoy some nice warm temperatures. What do you think? Should we go enjoy some of this weather? Yeah, he said yes. So anyway, all right, thanks for watching. I'm gonna take this little turkey here and uh, we're gonna go for a ride. I hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time.